you ever want to install something like a custom ROM or a custom kernel or any of the other modifications on your OnePlus 5, you're going to need to have a custom recovery installed on your device. And that's what I want to show you how to do today. So before we begin, you're going to need to have the bootloader unlocked. And you're going to need to have some stuff like ADB and Fastboot tools installed on your PC. The twerp, the TWRP image file for the OnePlus 5 on your computer. If you're unsure of where to find these files, how to install them, or how to set up ADB and Fastboot tools, then be sure to check the full tutorial below this video. Through the description below this video, as I'll have a link to the full tutorial that will walk you through all of that. So once you have everything set up on your computer, you're going to want to boot the OnePlus 5 into fast boot mode, which is also known as bootloader mode. And again, I've covered this in previous videos and tutorials which can all be found on my YouTube channel or on my website. And once we boot up into fast boot mode we can then connect the device to our PC with a USB cable. So once you download that TWRP image file again go ahead and rename it to TWRP.IMG and actually make sure that's the name and not twrp.img.img. I see a lot of people mistaking that. And then you're going to want to move or copy this file into the same directory as your ADB and Fastboot tools are located in. Because we're going to execute a, a Fastboot command for this file. So make sure your command prompt location is in the same place as your ADB and Fastboot tools are, as well as your twrp.img file is. And then we're just going to type out the command fastboot space flash space recovery space twrp.img. And instead of typing out that file name after the space. If you want, you can just drag and drop this twrp.img file into your command prompt and it will put the file location in there. Once all of that is done, we're just going to press enter on the keyboard. And as you can see, it's sending the recovery image to our OnePlus 5 that went okay then it wrote the recovery image to our recovery partition that went okay and then it took us back to the command prompt once that's done we can go ahead and unplug the USB cable from our PC to the OnePlus 5 and then we can press the volume down button until the, until the recovery mode option is highlighted. And we're just going to press the power button to select that option. That's going to reboot our OnePlus 5. And it's going to take us right into recovery mode. Which as long as everything went okay, that means it's going to boot us into TWRP. When you get to this screen, just swipe the white arrows to the right to complete this installation unless you want to keep it read only for systemless reasons. And once we have, once we are at the main menu here in TWRP, that means it is completely installed and it will always be there whenever you boot into recovery mode. Now from here, if you want to just use TWRP as it is right now, you can do so. You can do your backups. You can install some modifications. But if you reboot, 
then that will wipe the TWRP install and it will replace it with the stock recovery. To bypass this, we need to install any root solution, whether it is SuperSU, Majisk, or anything else. So once you are at the TWRP main menu and you want to fully install and keep it as your default custom recovery, you'll want to move the Majisk or SuperSU zip file from your PC to the OnePlus 5. You can do that by just connecting the USB cable and moving it over into the download folder. Then we're going to tap on install, browse to where we have that root solution zip file. In this instance, this is going to be Majisk. And we swipe the, the white arrows to the right. Once that is installed and done, we can just go ahead and tap on the Reboot System button. It's going to restart our OnePlus 5 and take us back into the Android operating system. So not only will that have TWRP installed on it now, but it will also have we will also be rooted and again it can be with either super su or majisk and just to show you that everything's done we have the majisk manager it's installed we're going to boot over into recovery mode real quick and again, if you do not install a root solution right when you boot up into TWRP, then the OnePlus 5 will replace TWRP with the stock recovery. So there you have it. That is how to install TWRP as the custom recovery on the OnePlus 5.